Want to learn how to get your 750 series drive working with an HOA switch? Stay tuned. A three position switch allowing for either local or remote control of a motor is a common sight in many industrial facilities. Said switches are referred to as handoff auto switches or HOA switches and allow a drive to be controlled by two different sources. Legacy drive installations included a circuit that provided two three wire start and stop signals simultaneously to the drive to accommodate the use of HOA switches. PowerFlex 750 series drives, however, will not start unless there's a full input cycle between the stop and start signals. To overcome this technical detail, parameter settings within the 750 series allow for signal delay, enabling the use of a single three wire control circuit by way of an HOA switch to start and stop the drive. Let's learn more about configuring a 750 for HOA control. Let's have a look at this simple HOA circuit. But before we begin, we should note that if both parameter 161 and parameter 176 are configured, a digital input configuration B alarm will result. It's not possible to use both digital input start and digital input handoff auto start simultaneously. With that in mind, let's see how this circuit works with the PowerFlex 750. When the switch is turned off, the circuit opens between the source and stop, digital input zero, and between stop and start, digital input one, causing the drive to assert stop. When the switch is turned to auto, the control signal reaches the stop input, but not the start, which allows the drive to be stopped and started by another location. When the switch is turned to hand, both the stop and start ports are energized. For the drive to start, the stop signal must be received before the start signal. With the wiring as shown, the signals are nearly simultaneous, too fast to be sure the drive is ready to start, which can make the switch unreliable and not work at all. To remedy this issue, a time delay needs to be added to the start signal. By changing digital input 1 from DI start to DI handoff auto start, the drive automatically adds this time delay and ensures that the system is ready to start before it receives the command. So there you have it the basic inner workings of the 750 series HOA start command. With the HOA start signal understood, let's now see how we can change the speed command between two different speed references. To take control of the drive speed when switching from auto to hand on the HOA switch, the auto manual feature can be used. Auto manual can be accessed by tying a digital input into the HOA switch to request manual control through parameter 172. Digital input manual control requests can be configured to use their own alternative speed reference to control the drive. In the circuit shown, a speed potentiometer is added to the analog input to provide a speed reference to the drive. When the HOA switch is moved from auto to hand, the digital input block requests manual control and issues a start command to the drive. If the digital input port receives manual control, the drive accelerates the reference speed from the analog input, and all attempts to change the speed except from the analog input are blocked. Note that the HIM still reads auto, and this display changes only when the HIM has control of manual mode. Note, if the drive is stopped while in hand, switch the HOA switch to off and then back to hand to restart the drive. Additionally, in this circuit, if another port has manual control of the drive but does not have exclusive ownership of the logic commands due to settings within parameter 326, the manual command mask, turning the switch to hand causes the drive to begin moving, but the analog input will have no control over speed. Setting up an HOA switch with a PowerFlex 750 series drive is easy and an effective way to add local control to machine or process. Have a look in the show description for parameter settings and have a good one.